Hello, Internet. This is Layers of Fear. My name is Whiskey Riddles, and, uh, yeah, fuck this game. So, we're back in the, uh, creepy painting room with, uh, yeah, yeah, fuck that. Um, so, it's sick and tired of us talking through these notes. We live in the same house, for God's sake. It's, yeah, these guys are passive-aggressive dickhole. Ah, anyway. Right. So, last time creepy bullshit was happening. Oh, okay, yeah, we haven't missed much. Um, just out of reach. Waiting for the slam. There we go. Yep, I remember that. Okay. Definitely nothing I can interact with here. Hmm. Have a nose around. Okay. Cool. Can I? Can. Fairly sure the ability to turn on the lights is entirely so that the uh, game can jump scare you by turning it off. Ah, so really, I shouldn't be playing the game's game. Fuck you, game. Not going to turn on lights just so you can turn them off and freak me out. The turn off lights so you can turn them on and reassure me. Yep, okay, we, we, yes, we are definitely going in circles. The fuck? The fuck? Oh. Okay, um. Satan is uh, having a little tea party. Wonderful. Ooh. Dear sir and madam, I kindly, albeit strongly, urge you to keep your voices down during the night. Marital problems, while regrettable, are a private matter. Should remain that way. There's certainly no consent to us, and especially our children. Please consider that not everyone is a freelance artist. Some of us have, have to get up early and work for a living. We need our sleep. We must also warn you, if things continue the way they are now, we'll be forced to call the police. Sincerely, your very tired neighbours. Well, as uh, the game has endeavoured to tell us time and again, we are a raging arsehole, and possibly a raging alcoholic. Uh, oh, noises. Noises can fuck off. Oh. Jesus Christ. Wind, stop being wind. <laughs> is that saying, yeah, is that my bad? Uh, yeah, no, that's, uh... Yeah. <laughs> I don't have no idea what time or even country this is set in. Hmm. Like, maybe it's just my bias, but I'm thinking England. But it could still be America. Yes. Just because we invented all the uh, cool gothic fucking horrific houses of doom doesn't mean that... Oh dear. Doesn't mean that America don't have a few. Not as many, but a few. Hmm. And there was the uh, newspaper clipping talking about shit happening in America with the Fed or something. Uh, uh, oh, what? Okay. Four eight five, gotcha. Jesus Christ. But, anyway, as I was saying before the game rudely interrupted me by making me fucking insane, um, yeah. Like, newspapers centering on America as a point of interest isn't exactly a new thing. It's always been the ship happening place until. Probably the last 20 years, in which case it's uh, not as fun. Right, I completely forgot. 4, 8, 5. Do hope they're in that order. Oh, good job. 4, 8. Eight, 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 eight. Hey, 4, 8, 5. Wonderful. Please do not have a severed head of my wife. What's in the box? What's in the box? Ooh. <laughs> Past holds back. Look closer. I don't want to look closer. 
to the whispering ring. Motherfucker, it's flickering. Oh Christ. The thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So will you marry me? That's a creepiest fucking voice, dude. Learn some romance, motherfucker. Oh my Jesus. <laughs> Hashtag never forget. Jesus Christ. Just gonna double check on these. Yeah, no. Fuck all. Okay, let's. Jesus. Everything terrifies me. Um... Hey, I've already just said, uh, compared to the first episode, I now have some lighting. Because that just did not work in the slightest. Fuck you. No thank you. Let me... I'm just gonna investigate this for a bit, and uh... Yeah. It uh... Gather my uh... My courage before I fuck around with a creepy rocking chair. Right? Let's do this. Not fucking with a rocking chair. Oh yay. You've been snooping around my workshop again! For the last time you're not allowed in that room, even the door happens to open. I forbid it! This is your last warning. Next time you'll have to look for a new job. Uh, okay, so he's talking to the butler, not his, his wife. Butler, or servant, or whatever the fuck they have. I don't know. I was thinking for a second that this was going to be a bluebeard thing, and, uh, yeah. What I'm also expecting it to be is a fucking Song of Sire thing. Uh, yeah, for those who don't know, Song of Sire, it's, um, it's like a anime visual novel type thing, which is, yeah, makes me look like a fucking nerd. I am a fucking nerd. Uh, not really my thing, but... I'm big on Lovecraft stuff, and as Lovecraft in horror goes, it's really good. Um, but yeah, trigger warnings. Uh, it's also very big on the whole murder and rape and pedophilia, and it gets really fucking disturbed. Um, but yeah, basically, uh, the main character sees the entire world as as like horrific, meaty, sort of silent, hilly, dark world type thing. Uh, and there is a ten-year-old girl who he has sex with, um, and she paints his room a nice, uh, calming green, and then it turns out that, of course, the world is normal, he's insane, uh, and she is a horrific monster who has painted his room with blood and gore and feces. Um, so I'm imagining that is going to be a sort of twist that this thing may do, uh, where our fucked up paintings are even more fucked up, and we're just insane. Uh, are you gonna stop spinning, please? Hmm. So, whoa, whoa, whoa. so I think it was on the North Pacific Ocean. Don't know. Well, maybe it's the North Atlantic Ocean. Whatever. I don't think that has any bearing. Hmm. But yeah, really nice uh, horror story. And I really enjoys drawing the audience over the lines of taboo and making you feel like fucking scum. Jesus Christ! Yep, you got me, game. Fucking hell. I was like, yeah, that's a fucked up hanging baby thing. Sweet. Yeah, I'm not prepared to be playing Song of Sire right now. I say playing, I mean reading. Um, Jesus. Because it makes you feel like shit, but at least you haven't actually shat yourself. Dust vice, even in my lungs. There's always more grotesque vermin dirt. Hey, someone's been playing Vermintide. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. 
Yeah, not going to try to squint through that. My love, even though you've not been born yet, I can already feel your presence. It's simply amazing. I just can't believe how lucky I am. A year ago, all I had was talent and ambition. Fucking smug cunt. Now against all odds, I have a career, a loving husband, and you. I've never been a deeply religious person. I guess what other people look for in a sermon I found and perfected my art. Oh. So his wife is also an artist. But now I can't help but feel like there's a higher power watching over me. The one's told me that I never succeeded as a musician. Oh, because you're the piano. Okay, yeah, fuck that piano, by the way. Uh, now I'm playing sword at concerts at some of the most pre prestigious ve venues in the country. Which country, you bitch? Uh, also said I had a difficult character. And that I'd never find a soulmate. Guess again, bitch. Uh, finally, a doctor once told me that I'd never be able to have children of my own. And yet, here you are within me. I'm quite possibly the happiest woman in the world. Rosemary's baby. She's gonna have a Satan child. I'm calling it. Yep. And because yeah, this God, don't do this to me. Oh, oh fucking Christ. No, no. Interesting candle. Interesting candle. Interesting candle. Fucking hell. Oh, I really should look at these things, but I'm a pussy. So, you get to look at me being scared instead. Fucking Christ. Uh, so, yeah. Oh. Uh, hey, if the game is going to torture me, at the very least, I can try and one up it and figure out what bullshit is going to be pulling. Why do you have a creepy fucking switch like that? Fuck you. Is this a hidden... Okay, you've got a fucking rape dungeon. I'm not a fan of that. And... Oh, Jesus. Okay. Another prediction. Dead by Dawn. That's going to be a fucking Evil Dead 2 reference. Or similar. I don't fucking trust you either. Jesus Christ. Okay, so that was where the hanging baby was, and it dropped me down a pit there. Now the baby's hanging there, I don't really want to walk towards the fireplace. But, I have no choice in the matter. Fuck you, game. No, let me out. I want to go back to the rape dungeon. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh, Jesus Christ. I have no sense of time about how long I've been doing this, by the way. Because I really just want to bail and uh, be like, Hey, we've done a 20 minute video, that's good enough, and then I don't know how long I've been going for. Hey, baby, how you doing? Can get out? I can. It wants me to go that way. I don't want to do what the game wants me to do, because games are dick. Spin me away with it. I mean, seriously? The wow, the soundtrack is really insistent that I'm going to be doing something creepy. Fuck's sake. Oh, well, this isn't going to go fucking weird. You know what this reminds me of is the, uh, the fucking portraits in the uh, Disneyland Haunted Mansion that have like the holographic skull images behind them. Okay, so, presumably, oh yeah, that's not weird. This is him going, oh, rats in the walls, rats in the walls, and fucking kick that open, trying to find them. And... Fucking dick penis fuck. I didn't read what was put under that. Jesus Christ. Now, a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all. As hot as that is, I. Why are you giving me scare arousal? This is not fair. Fucking hell. Fucking hell. Okay. Okay. Please open the door. Oh. Fuck you, game. 
can't crouch either. See, I sort of like the fact that I can't crouch because that means that I don't need to hide from something in the game. But that also means I can't hide from something in the game. And I'm not sure which it is. So, either I want to be able to hide and I can't, or maybe there's just... that is not an option. Screeching arsonist, echoing scream. They stop at nothing, I won't go down easy. I will go down easy, I'm... D end it. Kill me and end it. We're done. Give me a fucking bullet and a gun and I will put myself out of my misery and you don't even need to go through the trouble of murdering me. It's absolutely fine. Give me a rope and a... Scurvy arsonists. There's fucking fire rats over there. Jesus Christ. Yep. What the fuck? Jesus. God. That's fucked up. Okay. Cool. Can I open that under there? That seems important. I'm gonna read these books. What have we got? Got some Oscar Wilde. What is that? Well, picture of Dorian Gray. Oh, classic. Ah. <sighs> We got a dude fishing. Jeez. Oh, and a teddy bear. Wonderful. Uh, can't make out any other books. Uh, fine. Okay, to keep my mind on this, I am going to have to bitch about the League of Extraordinary Gentlemen movie because it's something. I just say, uh, of the, the fact that it's a absolutely horrendous shit show compared to the, uh, the Alan Moore comic. Dorian Gray was actually smart. Like, that was... I appreciated that. That's, that actually seems the sort of thing that the comic would do. Shame about the rest of it. Fuck me, I want to read it and you... What, and, 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 and. Fucking Christ. Okay, that's fine. Didn't want to read that anyway, you motherfucker. Oh, jeez, do I have a drink? Fuck this. It's in my fucking hand right now. No. Oh, I'm not having fun. Okay. Next room, then I'll make consider stopping. Oh, look, the, uh,. Creepy fucking portrait room doesn't exist. What a shocker. Fuck you. One of these fucking closets is going to have a jump scare painting in it. It's a weird phrase, jump scare painting. Never thought I'd have to use it. First time for everything. Oh, look. Can I read that? I can't read that. Nope, come on. Come on, there we go. Hey, sorry I haven't written in a while, I've been swarmed with work and flaming rats. I've got to tell you, after that letter was troubling, to say the least. I just can't believe she would set fire to old paintings. Why'd you do that? The Lady in Black especially. It was your tribute to her was. Really? Your tribute to your wife is the Lady in Black? Fucking hell. Oh, I don't know what to tell you except... Get, uh, get her some professional help. Oh yeah, she's the insane one. Fucking misogyny one over one over here. Uh, I've already talked to someone as well. With all that happened, I'm sure they'll do some good. But I don't need to tell you. But I was sorely disappointed with the news. New pieces are not selling as well as classics. Anyway, I'll keep looking. You just hang in there. Focus on your work. Oh, you still have it in you. I believe in you. Friend and agent, Thomas Cadwell. With fucking... I don't scribbles on it. Christ. Why is everyone so insane? Granted, it could be this guy who's insane, but we're doing on playing him. This is really the entire world here. That sucks. Oh, is this the just out of reach window? Yeah. I guess. Ooh, back here then. Nope. 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 
Ah, <sighs> this has been loads of fear. My name has been Whiskey Riddles, and I presume this hasn't actually saved anything. So we may have to do some of this again. I don't care. Goodbye. Ah. <sighs>